Messiland Arena of Solution and Power. Messiland Arena of Solution and Power. My name is Raoul Mbajue from Equatorial Guinea. My testimony goes like this. On 31st of December 2013, I saw a man in crossover night wearing uh, army, army uniform in my television screen. I look at it. Then it's like a voice telling me that this is your spiritual father. You must go to him. Then we cross over the night with him as he was breaking the clay pot. Uh -huh. He collect some clay pot, some clay in my house. We read the prayer point. We put inside. We break with him. Then I started following Prophet Jeremiah. Okay. From January to end February 2014, I got a job. I got a job in a company, in offshore company. I started working, working, working. 2015, I came here to see, by the very first time, to see the prophet. He prayed for me. I pay my first fruit. I pay everything. I pack the sun. Go back to my country. We pray, we pray. Every day we follow the service. We follow day and night. The Lord has been so faithful. The work that I got, they started helping me, promoting me, promoting me. But the challenges came. I cried unto God because it was a sad letter that I, I am waiting. God of Prophet Jeremiah, come to my rescue. I cannot bear this. I was seeking for a job. You are giving me a job. Now they are trying to sack me. I pray, I pray. The problem goes solved. Okay. But they reduce my salary. They reduce the salary. The salary becomes very small. That I cry, I cry. 2019, I come back. I say, this time, the Lord must help me. I partner with the prophet. I pack sun again, go back to my country. Pray, pray, pray. Then in 2020, now the Lord appear to my dream with the face of a woman, woman, one. He said to me, son, don't cry. Don't cry. Don't look at this salary. It's not the end. You will see who I am in the kingdom of God. Put your then, hands together for Jesus Christ. I woke up. I woke my wife. We pray. We give thanks to God. 2020, March of March, it was like a dream at my office in the lab, lab place where I checked the chemicals, crude oil, and gas. The Lord speak to me when I, bought, I was about to check the operation that we are doing at the offshore. The Lord spoke to me. I, I am the God of Prophet Jeremiah. I am the one that sent you to Prophet Jeremiah. You will own the companies and companies of the work that you are doing now. It was like I was not a dream. We finished the operation. I come back home. Then I started searching for gas and all this crude oil. For my surprise, I own today the experiment of a gas produced, not the fossil one that we take underground or under sea. I own a gas, a special gas from the God of Prophet Jeremiah. 
gas company from the God of Prophet Jeremiah. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. This is a wonderful testimony of a brother sharing here today. And today is a owner of gas plant in his own country. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. He's not working for any other person. He's the owner of his gas plant in his country. And people are working for him. He was working for people, but today, people are working for him. If you are here listening to this testimony, you are a worker here. I pray today because you listen to this testimony, people are going to walk under you in the name of Jesus. Yes, sir, we are seeing some documents on the board. Can you please throw more light? Yes. Not only that, because now the Lord gave me the experiment. I work on the experiment, and the experiment gave me result. In my country, a project like this, you cannot establish it without involving the government. Now I started searching for sponsors, searching for partners. Then I go in the Ministry of Mine and Industry. They directed me to the Vice President to prepare my CV and everything concerning the gas plan. Then the government give me the license and then to establish the company. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. And you can see the picture here. This is the evidence of what our brother is testifying all about. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Okay, sir, we want to know there are many people watching you right now through Mercy TV and people that are sitting down here listening to this wonderful testimony. What is your advice to them? Yes, the first advice to all over the world is to come to the prophet of God here at Mercy City. Any problem you face in your country here in Nigeria, you have the grace here, you people that are in Nigeria, you don't know what you have in your midst. But we know when you come outside your country, we know what is here. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Voilà, certes, téléspectateurs, nous venons de suivre ces merveilleux témoignages de notre frère venant de la Guinée équatoriale. Il disait que en 2000, l'an 2000, il était à la recherche de boulot et jusqu'à ce qu'il est venu ici à Christmas Island pour chercher la face de l'Éternel. L'homme de Dieu a prié pour lui, l'avait localisé et il a prié pour lui. Et quand il est retourné chez lui, il a obtenu un boulot. Non seulement le boulot, un bonjour étant dans ce lieu de travail, dans cette société, il y avait eu des problèmes qui s'est surgi dans ce, cette société et ils ont cherché à vouloir le limoser de cette société. Et voilà comment, une fois de plus, il a prié, imploré le Dieu du prophète Jérémie d'intervenir. Et tout d'un coup, et ils n'ont pas pu le, le limoger mais ils lui ont pardonné, mais son salaire a été réduit à zéro. Et il continue à prier, intercéder. Un bon jour encore, il est revenu encore à Christmas Island pour chercher la face de l'Éternel. Et le Dieu du prophète Jérémie l'avait localisé. Et quand il est retourné chez lui, euh, le boulot dont il travaillait, on lui avait donné une promotion pour pouvoir être responsable de la partie qui faisait l'examination des produits pétroliers. Et quand il avait fini cela, il a entendu la voix de l'Éternel qui lui dit ce que vous êtes en train de faire dans cette société, dissiper, vous allez devenir le propriétaire de votre propre compagnie. Et voilà comment, après quelques jours, le Dieu de Prophète Jérémie a ouvert des portes et il a pu obtenir sa propre compagnie de gaz. Et c'est pourquoi il est revenu à nouveau pour dire merci au Dieu de Prophète Jérémie pour cette percée dans ses affaires. Applaudissements pour le Seigneur. Yes, sir, we rejoice with you. We advise you made the word of God a standard for your life. By so doing, you are coming back for more and greater testimonies in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus.